Hey YouTube, I just wanted to make this quick video on why not to buy a tortoise from PetSmart. Now, a lot of first time tortoise owners, they love just to go to PetSmart, Petco, and they buy their tortoise. And they don't know what they're getting themselves into. But let me tell you guys a little story. This right here, his name is Ayoki. He's my Russian tortoise. He's five years old. I've had, no, I've had him for five years, but when I got him, I'm going to say he was around three years old. He's, he's fairly healthy. He's, he's really mobile. He walks around. You know, he eats. He poops regularly. He's, he's a perfectly healthy tortoise. Yes, I got, I've gotten him from PetSmart. I did, and I won't lie about that. But I don't recommend getting them from PetSmart. I don't recommend anybody getting their tortoise from PetSmart. And if you're wondering why, well, let me tell you the story I was going to recite for you. <clears throat> Five years ago... When I first got into tortoises and I wanted to get me a tortoise, you know, I didn't know where to buy them. I didn't know if I should buy them online. You know, they ship them to you in little boxes. But, you know, I wish that was a route that I went, but I didn't. I ended up going to PetSmart. Why? Because it's the, you know, it's a big franchise. Everybody goes to PetSmart for dog food for, oh my gosh, he just flipped. Come on, get that shit, Ayoki. Get that shit. Is he wiggling? Yeah. yeah. Ooh, yeah. Yes, Ninja Turtles and training, boy. Anyways, let me get back to this story real quick. Okay, so, uh, when I first wanted to buy my tortoise, I went straight to PetSmart. That's the first thing I did because why they sell tortoises? You know, they, they have about six, seven in a little tiny aquarium. They sell Russian tortoises. They, I think they sell um, red foot tortoises. I don't know if they do anymore. But anyways, I went and I bought my tortoise with all kinds of other useless stuff I didn't need to buy. And it wasn't this tortoise you see here. I had bought two tortoises together. And they were both Russian tortoises. I brought them home. I had them in the aquarium. First of all, you're not even supposed to have them, have them in an aquarium. But I don't think that really had to do with what I'm going to get into right now. When I bought these tortoises... I named them Ryu and Ken. The first tortoise that I had bought in, he didn't want to come out of his shell. For like, I had him for about two weeks. He didn't want to come out of his shell. I mean, his little head stuck out and all that, but he didn't want to come out and eat. He wasn't active. Nothing like that. So, so I was wondering, what's wrong with him? And um, he just wouldn't eat, man. He he would, he had little bubbles coming from the sides of his mouth. He had uh, his his eyes looked really webbed, and he, I would put him to soak in water. He wouldn't even come out to drink water. He was basically just full of parasites, man. Just just infested with them. And uh, so I told myself, what's wrong with him? I tried to feed him how, better lettuce. I did better research. And then I came across um, a site. I, I forgot the name of the site. But people were complaining about their tortoises that they have bought in from PetSmart. What PetSmart does, they buy their, their uh, tortoises. I don't know from who, but they buy them wild caught now what wild caught means that these tortoises were born and they thrived in the wild now you might say oh well that's good you know that that's more more natural well it isn't because tortoises that are out in the wild they're full of parasites you know they they live out in disease and dirt and and they just they eat nasty things and they drink nasty little puddles of water and they get parasites and you know i i had to return him and i got another tortoise and um, that's who you see now. His name's Ayoki. But well, anyways, the other tortoise that I... Because I told you I had bought two tortoises. I had to return one. Well, the other tortoise, he got sick too. He he didn't want to eat no more. He started looking really compacted. Like like if he was getting big. Like like fat. Like his shell was just too big. And they, I wasn't overeating him. They weren't eating on their dirt. You know, they, they just... He, he just wasn't eating right. And that's the second tortoise I had to return. And and I told myself, I said, you know what? It's just a waste. It's it's a waste buying tortoises what, from, from PetSmart. Why even do that? Because all they do is sell you sick tortoises. So for you people out there that want to buy a tortoise for the first time, do, don't get your tortoise from PetSmart. Just make, make the call to go somewhere else. I suggest you buy them at, um, at websites online. They, they, they breed them. They're called tortoise farms. Not form. Don't get me wrong. It's called tur tortoise farms. They breed their tortoises captive bred. Now what captive bred means, 
that they have tortoises that they've raised from hatchlings and um, they breed them. So the tortoises comes out healthy, clean, and this little guy's shell's all scraped up and scratched up from when I bought him. And um, you'll, you'll get a perfectly healthy tortoise. Your tortoise will be so clean and healthy if you buy captive bred tortoises. And um, so I, I suggest, please, you guys, please, if you're going to buy yourself a tortoise for the first time, beware. PetSmart sells more than half of their tortoises parasitic and sick. Don't waste your time and money and effort. I'm telling you right now, be patient. Don't don't be overexcited because you're going to make a mistake buying that tortoise from PetSmart. It is a big no. I got lucky that I got this guy and he was healthy. But what? I had to return two tortoises in order to get this guy. And I think you have 14 days to return return your tortoise. So, you know, if you exceed, exceed those 14 days, you're stuck with a sick tortoise that you wasted money on. You know, I don't know how much they go for right now at PetSmart. I think they, they're from anywhere from, from $50 to $100. But you know what? Why not pay that little bit of extra money to get yourself a perfectly fit and fine tortoise from, from an online breeder? They're, they're very beautiful tortoises. All tortoises are beautiful. And, you know, you want to get yourself a nice, healthy tortoise, don't waste your time with PetSmart, guys. It, it's a big waste. Believe me, take my word for it. I went through it, man. It was so stressful. And then you feel bad for the little tortoises because they're sick. And, you know, they could get people sick. If you have kids around your house or, you know, if you have a weak immune system and you go touch that tortoise and you don't know that it's sick, you're going to get sick, you know. And it could spread disease to dogs or cats or other tortoises that you have because they're full of parasites. So just don't don't waste your time and, and shop at PetSmart for your tortoise. You know, don't get me wrong. PetSmart has a lot of good stuff. Yeah, they got good dog food. They 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 even um, you could adopt dogs and cats and they're they're a really cool place. But for your tortoises, you guys, be smart, be patient, and do your research. So I hope you guys um soaked up some information from this video. Hit the like button and subscribe if you can. Thanks for watching.